Hey everybody, so this week we're going to be doing a Pokemon review, I came out of Ignition News, so let's, let's get started, and shit. Hey everybody, so this is this technically is my first ever Pokemon figure review, and again, this is a Pokemon from the Sun and Moon, and this is Solgaleo. This is one of the legendary Pokemon, and it's actually based on, I guess, on the game Sun and Moon that I still haven't played. But again, if you guys don't know, I'm, I am a huge Pokemon fan. I used to, you know, when I was a kid, I watched it. And then also I used to play with the cards and also play with the um, Game Boy Advance, also DS and all that, etc. <laughs> but pretty much tells you all the basic stuff and it shows you that it has 15 point, art, you know, joints or articulation and all the other Pokemon. So um, let's open this baby up and get a bigger look at Solgario. All right, guys. So first, I'm going to give you a better look at the figure itself. It looks very cool. Scope wise, um, we're gonna take a you know, check out articulation in a bit, but it looks very nice. It's a beautiful figure, very basic but very, very nice. I really do like this. <laughs> All right, so now let's test the articulation, but also get a better look at it. So, like I said, it looks beautiful, very nice the way they capture him. Um, paint, I really like this. Uh, like I said, again, <laughs> scope wise, it's really awesome. He does have a little paint and kind of scratch bumps, I could just use to sand that down a little bit, but yeah. He's a basic toy, so that you know, I'm not gonna be like so like like oh, it needs to be detailed, really nice. It's just very, it's very nice. The, and in the paint wise, look, you guys can see the face, what they do with the eyes, everything. It's really nice. Uh, uh, I think it's sticker or paint, I'm not sure, but they really did capture him really cool. Like how they, the whole stars right there, they added. It's a uh, nice detail work right there. And the eyes look very cool. They look very plain, but very, very, very awesome looking. <laughs> uh, I still haven't played the game. I really want to play the game. Uh, but yeah, I, I know it's been years, but still. <laughs> Alright, so let's test the articulation. So articulation wise, wise is basic, but he has 15 joints of, uh, 15 points of articulation. And that's really cool for, for a figure of this size. Uh, so just look at the scope wise on his legs. Uh, <laughs> again, it's a detail work. Uh, so like, I, again, I, he just have basic articulation um his leg does bend all the way around like that as you can see it could, it could bend to the side a little bit but mostly front more um you guys can see it has a joint right there and the other side the same it has a joint so you can actually bend his leg love that um uh, back and forth not all the way does block a little bit and he does have a pink um ankle, ankle pelvis sorry and it does bend pretty good the ankle pitch is very loose very um it bends pretty much really good so he does have like a stomach hip joint kind of thing you guys can see it doesn't bend back and forth that much but it's loose enough so you guys can move him shape him up a little bit when he's standing i love that they added that um front legs do bent forward and back a little bit to the side not much again he does have his leg does bent um and also he does have ankle privilege in front of his legs as well as you guys can see i do love that the ankle privilege in this figure is very loose and very flexible like that. He does his head does move, but because of the way his shape of his hair is, it doesn't gives it very limited uh, movement. But that's pretty much it. So, all right, folks. So that's pretty much it. So let me tell you about the good and just a little bad. The good is that this toy is beautiful when it comes to scope wise, paint wise, and articulation. I love it. Bad is I feel like it was a little bit rush when he I guess when he made it because there was like a lot a little scratches of paint and also the paint's kind of lumpy and lurks the spot. So I'm guessing when they were the freshly made at factory it was rush that's the only bad thing about it so let's talk about this so um i got mine as a gift from a friend for christmas uh sadly this is something that um for a while it came out already but i couldn't find it and i was freaking out i really wanted to get this and i can only, i only saw this online for going for about more than about 40 50 retail price this goes for us about 20 1999 20 and you can usually find this at targets or Toys R Us. i think my friend who got this for me actually Got it for me at I, I Toys R Us. So they're starting to come out over here. And if you live in California, definitely check out your stores if you really wanted to get this figure. It's really cool. Uh, I prefer you guys get it now because in the future it's going to cost way more <laughs> after this continues. So I hope you enjoy this. This is Mr. Bushido signing out. I came out to get news.